So cleaning is done. Engine bay is all nice and shiny again. All the rat droppings are gone. We've already started pulling all the suspension apart. Bits and bits and bits and bits are being replaced. There's the first lot of stuff, bits that are arriving. Ah, uh, car full of parts. I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit. I got no love for the fakeness. If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this, I'll always show up and make a statement. I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit. I got no love for the fakeness. If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this. Now the attention turns to the interior. I think Mickey Mouse has been sleeping in here. So, let's start getting cracking on this interior, shall we? Bit of a before shot. Oh, and Mickey Mouse wet the bed there. Now being an electric seat, we have to put the battery back on. Oh, this one's going to take a shitload more work. But anyway. <laughs> being an electric seat, gotta make sure Seats are folded all the way forward. So, getting them out is a lot easier. Sure, you remove your battery, the power from your battery, before you take the seats out. Otherwise, you will get a airbag warning on your computer, on your dash. Right. Make sure there's no power in the system before undoing those connectors. Otherwise, you will get an airbag warning. And you'll have to get it removed. Okay. There's your airbag. Uh, there's a pair for your seat. Well, car's repaying off for itself. Come with some 10 cents there. 20 cents there. Oh, let's go on the next one. Black ice for later. Sean, what are you up to? Get 
Nintendo. So cleaning is now done. As you can see, all the crap's all gone, but we've still got shitloads of dirty stains, a bit of mouse wee, and that. So, first time using the Pistol Steam Cleaner in a car situation, but this is obviously dirtier than any caps and carpet that I have inside. So, let's see what this little baby can do. Well, one side done for its first run. I'm gonna do two passes, so we'll come back tomorrow and do the side again. But onto the next side. But just to show you, so one side, one pass. Oh, look at that lovely, lovely juice. On. I have your smoothie ready. Alright. Drive aside. Alright, then it dri dried overnight and the stains have come back to the surface so we know where to tackle again. So if you're down here again, a few more bits of sock out so it's going to take a while until that comes clear. So let's hit it again. So I decided to use some bit of a extra hand with some Oxy Plus power out. So we're going to spray it. Yeah, this bottle was a bit old. And then, 
Drill with a brush. Let's see what we can do. Oh, just did another pass with the machine. Looks fine, but if there's any stains below the carpet or, li or extra liquid, it will come through. So it is what it is really, especially down this corner. But I'll hit it again with the machine later on, just sucking only and see what extra liquid I can pull out. Yep. On to some more action. Well, we put the stuff with the interior back together. Um, so the console's back in. Basically, it's got to go on. It's all been lathered up and moisturised. So it's got to soak in. I've got to finish off putting the trim together. Carpet's still okay, but that red stain's still there. And I've just got to slowly put the puzzle back together. Just after midnight. Why not? Now, because the seat was in a tilted position and we need to go back flat so we can get all in the crevice, made a little dry rig connector to the battery. So, you can open it. Well, it's come up a bit nicer. Still, some of the stains in there that I'm slowly working on, but yeah, it's definitely a lighter colour than before. We'll lather it up with some good old Vaseline. Just like make the hands all nice and soft. If anyone wants to know what I use, I use Oakwood Leather Care products. They seem to be very good and revive any old leather back to new again. Mm -hmm. Alright. All lathered up. That will soak in, open the pores, and next time I go and come to clean the seat, I should be able to get into those. Video is a bit better. Well, let's move on to the other seats. So, just out of the driver's seat, it's come up alright. I haven't done the bottom yet. So, it's going to be a bit of a mission. So, first clean hydrate done. Definitely less brown, but because the actual Lever itself has degraded. And I'm going to bring those dark spots at the back. So, give it another clean, let the hydration, let it hydrate, soak in, get softer, and we'll give it another clean and another hydrate. Well, that's all we got time for today. 
seats are all done. Um, I won't be putting back in the car yet because we still have to do some uh, interior work. Pretty much going to pull that dash apart again and do the, all the AC in there. Do a new evaporator core. So you'll see that in a later episode. Um, but yeah, wait for the next one. Don't start pulling all the suspension apart.